May is Asian American and Pacific Islander Heritage Month, and one startup is capturing the essence of this month here in the tri-state area. As CBS 2's Lisa Rosner shows us, it's all in an effort to support local businesses. It looks cooler than it feels. Let me have you look here. In the heart of Manhattan's Great. Chinatown, photographer okay, Lucas Zhao takes portraits of Chris Kuo. She runs Taiwan Bear House on Pell Street, a street she wasn't sure would come back to life during the height of the pandemic in 2020. I remember at that time that on the Pell Street, there's only two restaurants still open and the streets are all empty. But now tourists are starting to return. There's a very famous dim sum restaurant. Quo immigrated from Taiwan and opened her restaurant in 2015. She estimates foot traffic is only 60 to 70 percent of what it used to be. But the on-demand photography service Shoot is hoping to change that by literally putting on display the beautiful backdrops of AAPI communities. In the month of May for AAPI Heritage Month, the company led by Asian Americans is holding photo sessions in 30-minute blocks in New York City's Chinatown, Koreatown, and Little Manila, as well as across the river in New Jersey's Koreatown in Fort Lee and Little India in Edison. Go support a cultural institution. There's so many great restaurants run by um, immigrant owned businesses. There is no sitting fee, so clients only pay for the photos they want. Part of the proceeds will go to stopaapihate.org, a nonprofit which tracks and responds to incidents of hate against Asian Americans and Pacific Islanders in the U.S. Starting with the pandemic, there's been an uptick in violence for the Asian community. So we were thinking, like, how can we really support the AAPI community with our business model? Because of the hate crime, so we, like, shorten our business hours. And the organization Send Chinatown Love says some businesses have suffered revenue losses between 60 and 80 percent during the pandemic. That's why the nonprofit connected Shoot with Taiwan Bear House when it wanted to donate a free photo session, taking glamour shots of their signature bento boxes for marketing materials and providing a morale boost. I'm very proud of being Taiwanese. The core of it is just to remember who we are and to um, not be ashamed of it and to share that. Let me have you in Chinatown, Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News. Yeah.